Frederick Forrest, a character actor who had a standout performance in the film Apocalypse Now in 1979 and was nominated for an Academy Award for his work in The Rose in the same year, passed away on Friday in Santa Monica. He was 86. Ginger Jackson, Forrest's sister, has stated unequivocally that her brother has passed away. Bette Midler, who co-starred with the actor in Rose, was the one who broke the news first and paid tribute to him on Twitter. Midler noted in an email that the great and beloved Frederick Forrest has passed away. I want to express my gratitude to all of his friends and fans for all of the love they've shown him over the past few months. It was a blessing to have him as a friend since he was not only a wonderful actor, but also a remarkable human being. He had found his calm. Forrest plays the tightly wound former New Orleans chef on the river patrol boat named J. Chef Hicks in Francis Ford Coppola's Apocalypse Now. Hicks rants, I didn't come here for this. I don't fucking need this. All I wanted to do was fucking cook before he is killed later in the film. Forrest is subsequently beheaded himself. He also appeared in One from the Heart, The Conversation, Hammett and Tucker, The Man and His Dream, all of which were directed by Coppola. Gene Hackman's voice may be heard throughout the conversation when he records Forrest's titular discussion with Cindy Williams. This conversation is audible throughout the entirety of the film. Freddie Forrest was a sweet, much-beloved person, a wonderful actor, and a good friend. Coppola stated in a statement following Forrest passing away, referring to the actor's life and career, it breaks my heart that he had to go through this. In the film Falling Down, Forrest portrayed the role of the white supremacist owner of an army surplus store who is gunned down by Michael Douglas's character, Foster. In addition, he had roles in the movies The Missouri Breaks, The Two Jakes, Point Blank, and Valley Girl, as well as the first American picture directed by Dario Argento, titled Trauma. On television, he has made appearances in The Miniseries Lonesome Dove and Quo Vadis, as well as in the series 21 Jump Street. Forrest was presented with the Distinguished Alumni Award after completing his education at Texas Christian University, which he began on December 23, 1936 in Waxahachie, Texas. After that, he became an apprentice of Sanford Meissner and began his acting career on stage with a part in the off-Broadway production of Viet Rock. He relocated to Hollywood, where he was cast in his debut film, When the Legends Die which led to a nomination for a Golden Globe in the category of Most Promising Newcomer in 1973. Forrest is survived by his sister, Ginger Forrest Jackson, and her husband, David, his nephew and niece, Forrest Allen Jackson, and Sally Jackson Brezik, and Jackson Galbraith, Leah Jackson, and Helen Sanders, all of whom reside in the Los Angeles area. Forrest also leaves behind his parents, David Lee Jackson, the man's nephew, passed away before him. He had two previous marriages, the second of which was to Marilu Henner. In 1983, they got a divorce. Thanks for watching.